Matt Bromage is a doctor from Chio, and after a couple of years of research, he's created a couple of ways to, well, almost cure vertigo. Uh, we got Matt in the studio this morning. Now, before you tell us about what you created, we uh, better begin at the beginning. What is vertigo? Well, vertigo is the sensation of motion when and you're not actually moving. And there's a number of different ways that can happen. The most common cause of vertigo related to the ear is called BPPV, which stands for benign paroxysmal positional vertigo, which means at periods of time when you lay down in certain ways, you'll get short periods of spinning. Uh, typically, people describe either their room spinning or themselves spinning. And a BPPV can be really irritating because it happens whenever you lay down, whenever you roll over, whenever you look under something, sometimes when you look up as as if you were changing a light bulb um, and you get spinning dizziness and can be quite disabling. And not only that, but it's actually ridiculously common. About 1 in 10 people over the age of 60 will have BPPV. So many of your parents will have BPPV and may not even know it. It's one of the types of dizzinesses that will come and go as well. So you may have it for a while and then kind of try and wait it out. And it might go away, but then it'll come back again. To solve this is, my understanding, quite simple. And you've come up with two products. One is a physical product called Dizzy Fix. And you also have an app that you can treat on your smartphone. So I'll get you to uh, first uh, describe the, the actual physical uh, product, uh, Dizzy Fix. We've actually had a lot of fun developing both of these products. The initial uh, cure treatment was developed by Dr. Epley in 1992. And uh, it was quite a struggle for him to uh, have people understand why this type of maneuver, rolling somebody around, would cure any type of disease. And I think it's worthwhile explaining a little bit about how dizziness works. So your body has a couple of sensors in it, one that detects gravity and one that detects rotation or acceleration. And it does that by little crystals that are inside your ear. And if you think of it like a snow globe, there's these crystals inside the snow globe and they're supposed to be stuck down to work properly. But in BPPV, they come loose and they fly around. And if they fly into the wrong spot, they can actually cause dizziness, which is the disease BPPV. And so the treatment is rolling this snow globe very carefully so these crystals will roll out of a sensitive area uh, and into an area that doesn't cause you any, any problems. And that's really how the Dizzy Fix work. It's, it's sort of a map. Um, if you ever played that game with a, with a maze and a ball in it, that you tilt the maze and the ball rolls around. Oh, yeah. This is very similar to that, but instead of a maze, it's just the m a model of the inner ear. And so you attach this device to your hat. It looks kind of like a, um, a wishbone uh, tube with uh, some fluid and a particle in it and you attach it to your hat and it, as you tilt your head the particle moves and that's moving like the particles in your own ear so you play the game but in this case if you win the game you're also cured <laughs> which is a nice benefit <laughs> it's the live 885 startup david schellenberg and john moran in this morning we're talking with matt bromwich he's invented a couple of devices that can almost cure vertigo so, Matt, uh, in addition to the, the hat, you've also got an app. And uh, how does this app work? Well, the, uh, we were very happy with the physical Dizzy Fix device. Uh, but one of the limitations we had is you have to receive it in the mail or get it from a pharmacy. And so we thought, is there a way of using the iPhone, which also has accelerometers in it or s gravity sensors in it, to guide you through the maneuver? And although it looks a bit funny, if you actually put an iPhone on your head, it can tell you where your head is in space. And as you tilt your head, it'll tell you that it's tilting certain degrees. Now, of course, if it's on your head, you can't see the screen, uh, which is one of the limiting factors, which is why it's really designed for family doctors. So a family doctor who's able to identify BPPV in a patient, because what you do is you lay them down and you tilt the head to the side and they get something called nystagmus and dizziness. And nystagmus is a twitching eye motion, which is really characteristic only of BPPV. So it's quite easy to identify it if you have it. So once you're in that position, it'd be really nice to treat it. And if you're not sure how to do the maneuver, the iPhone app allows you to do the maneuver successfully and guides you through it. So you take the phone, you put it on your patient's head, and as the family doctor, you can see the screen. So you follow the instructions and turn the patient's head appropriately. And again, that should take you through the correct maneuver, which ideally would give you a success rate about 85% with one maneuver. Wow, that's pretty remarkable how easy that is to do. That's uh, Matt Bromage. He's a doctor from Geo. Matt, thank you for coming into the studio this morning. If you want to see more about what this product is, um, definitely we've got a link to it off of our website, and you can find a link to his product off of our website that is at www.live885.com.